Check this out. Because I'd found the answer to a riddle. Delays are kind of like reverbs. One just isn't enough. Every sound arsenal should have at least a couple of good options. And the more power and flexibility those delays have, the better. I've got about four or five really good ones, and they are all excellent tools. I'll start with Sandman Pro by Unfiltered Audio. This is a really powerful delay with multiple programmable LFOs, lots of glitch potential, and it's pretty inexpensive if you get it on sale. Be sure to get the Pro version of this though, because it's totally worth the few extra bucks. A little higher up the price scale is Other Desert Cities by Audio Damage. Totally worth the extra money. I can't tell you the number of times I've just dropped one of the first two or three presets on a vocal track or synth patch and it made it come alive. UVI has two good options, Relayer and Dual Delay X. These are also a little more money, but again worth it for the sheer amount of flexibility and ease of use on both. The new cluster delay from Minimal Audio came out recently and looks very cool. It's on my list, but I haven't picked that one up yet. A few days ago, however, I happened to come across a delay I had not seen before. Dataless Delay by Acousmatic Audio. This looked pretty cool and was on sale for about 19 bucks. That's a pretty good price considering you get a lot of standard delay stuff, plus a delay based on pitch, some sort of granular thing thrown in, filters, overdrive, and eight completely programmable LFOs. That's a heck of a lot of power for the price of about four of them hipster coffee drinks. May I have a half-calf, decaf, mint mocha latte, foam on the bottom, served in a flower vase. I can't say I know a lot about Acousmatic Audio, other than that they are very new and that this is their first plugin. It's a heck of a good start, and this delay is going to find a lot of use in my studio. So, let's take a look. Holy moly. First, I want to talk about the modulators, because this is a key selling point. There's eight, which is huge. But what's even better is how easy it is to set these up. Just double click to add new points and click and hold to drag. With a few clicks you can make some pretty crazy envelopes. It's super easy to assign these also. Just drag the red mod number to the control and it's there. You can adjust how much is modulated by dragging up and down on the text below each dial and adjust the overall value the same way. You can make these totally random also. Pick either the hold, linear, or curve buttons here. Other randomization features include a percentage dial for the main delay, one for the granular section, and there is a random pan also. So rather than blab on about the features, let's listen to some of the presets and you'll be able to hear how this thing performs. So that's it for today. Daedalus Delay and Acousmatic Audio get a thumbs up from Arctic Fox Studios. This is a great creative delay option that can be very subtle and also glitchy as heck and should be on your to purchase list. Hope you are making some great music somewhere. Be sure to tip those waiters and baristas on your way out and we will see you on the other side of the mountain. Thank you, cafe craftsman. You're welcome. Sorry, he, he didn't actually pay for that drink. I got it.